Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In today's video you will find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators EMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By taking a closer look at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price went down only slight by about 0.2% in the last 24 hours and has a current price of 50,829. Jumping to the hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is in the hourly ribbon, so you should see if the ribbon could hold support, currently at around 50,200. The support should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. On the lookout for divergences in the hourly time frame, there is a bearish divergence, which means the price could go down from now or at least consolidate for some time. Looking at the hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are currently very low, which means that the price is oversold and a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation is to be expected. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Moving to the hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the downside. Looking at the three hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the three hourly ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 49,004. The ribbon is relatively spread out so the support should be considered. Jumping to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but we can see that the trend is currently going down because the K line is below the D line. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time. time.